you know, it's funny. <laughs> because they tell you, start anywhere. And typically, we should start at the beginning. But my story is more fragmented. It's, it's bits and pieces all glued together to form a book that doesn't really make sense. It's not quite a cliffhanger. But that's besides the point. You see, You know, I told myself I wouldn't get emotional over this, but here it is taking over me yet again. <laughs> when I was six years old, I, I ran in the woods and I felt free, you know? <laughs> I kept running and it was a nice sunny day. Oh, I could still feel the warm sun rays on my skin, kissing it as if like that was where I was meant to be that day. I was just six years old. I, I always listened. I, I was a good kid. <laughs> so one day just having fun, just, just, it, it felt normal. It was needed. <laughs> Maybe sister was home with my mom. And the force was right next to our house, you know. I just, I didn't, I didn't hear her when she yelled. <sighs> and I still think it's my fault. I, I know. I know it's not. What could a six year old do anyway? Like I could change the world at that age, which is so weird. Because now, well, <laughs> I don't really know anything anymore. <laughs>